Welcome to Real Beauty with Tamara Lords. Today we're going to talk about how to get these DIY lashes off. Oh, my voice like totally cracked. I think I have a pubescent teenager. These are my new favorite situation. These have been out for two weeks. Now, I've been trying this method out for like two and a half months, so I'm really excited about how they've been staying on, but it's probably a good idea to know how to get them off so you're not gonna ruin your lashes. So, all you need are three very specific items. Q-tips, warm red, gel remover. There we go. B.O. Lashes, gel remover. I will link it below because I love you. Here's the process. It's all about being patient. That's really all it is. So what you're gonna do is you're gonna put some on your Q-tip. You're gonna put it on here, and then you're gonna just close, keep your eye closed. You guys wanna keep your eye closed because this could um, sting your eye. You wanna make sure it, you keep your eye closed. Now, if, if it stings, that's what warm rag is for. You just kinda like hold it there, and then at the very end, I like to wash them off with a warm rag. Okay, now you're gonna just put it on here, and you just start rolling in an outward motion, okay? Sometimes I will tap it on, but just watch the process. That's the easiest way to do it. Can I get it out? Come on, Jill. Come on, Jill. Squeeze! Okay, it's coming. Okay, that should probably be good. You know, I'm just going to tap it onto the edge of the lashes. And I'm going to angle my face down so that you can kind of see what I'm doing. Keeping my eyes closed. You can see that my lashes have grown. So my lashes are still growing. Bonus tip, use a lash growth serum while you're doing your lashes. Helps them stay strong and thick and all the things. But you're gonna start to see these break down, which is really good. Now just be gentle and soft, and eventually it's gonna come off. You really will. Okay, what I want you to notice is as they're coming off, there's no natural lash attached to this. So it's not taking off my lashes, it's just taking off the extensions that I put on. You don't want to destroy your natural lashes, right? I mean, that is like, that would be tragic. I have had bad lash jobs by professionals, and these, I have no fallout from any of these. I've got three that have come off and zero to fall out, which is so amazing. Oh, I can see this one's coming right off. I wish I could open my eye right now because it will look real funny. We're getting close. Ooh, we got a hanging, a hanging lash. Oh, I opened my eye. Don't do that, Tamara. It really, yes, it stings. If you open your eye, it's going to sting. Here, let's look at this big chunk. Look at this big, there's like a fuzzy on it. I'm like, let's get the fuzzy. Last little lashy. Oh, it's so close. Oh, there it is. So I'm going to take my wet rag and I'm just gonna pat. I'm not gonna rub too much. Oh, it actually feels really nice to rub. <sighs> Cause you can't rub your lashes. When, when you have extensions on, I do a lot of like, I push instead of rub. Oh, that didn't work with my contracts though. Crisis averted. Look at the difference. Whoa, I look so crazy. <laughs> Hello. But here's what I want to note. I'm gonna get real close. Hopefully you can tell. I need somebody in here to help me. Hopefully you can see that I still have a lot of lashes. There's still a good amount of lashes on there. Do not do what I just did. I got impatient and I was like, oh, it's almost there. I'm gonna like hold a little bit. Oh. A little lash off. Can you see it? E e e. I can't tell. Okay. <sighs> Guys, just be patient. The rolling method works. Don't just, don't pull it. Just slightly roll. <gasps> now I feel naked. Especially with these brows. Like, can you even take me seriously with no lashes? No shadow. Mm, brows. But hey. Let me know what you think of this video, of this tutorial. Let me know if you try this. 
or if you have any tips or tricks for how to get lashes off, or if you found a remover that you like even better than this one, let me know. I want to know about this stuff. Join me next time. I need to take my contact out. Should I do it on the screen here? It's weird to get out my contacts. Like, subscribe, find me on all the social media platforms. You know what to do, and I love you. And now goodbye.